Top 10 Destinations in Uzbekistan Uzbekistan is one of the fascinating countries in Central Asia and famous for its silk road cities of Samarkand, Bukhara, and Kiva. Twice the size of the UK, it has a rich cultural heritage and a long history steeped in tradition. From such a rich list of important places to visit, things to do and an enormous variety of sightseeing tours on offer, we present you with our pick of Uzbekistan travel. Top 10 Places to Visit Number 1 Samarkand Samarkand, crossroad of cultures is the official moniker used to describe this city as a UNESCO World Heritage Site. However, this is no fairy tale, Samarkand today is a lively city that cherishes its traditions. The area was continuously inhabited and served as a melting pot of diverse cultures. Number 2 Bukhara the historic center of Bukhara has been an important base for Islamic theology and science for several centuries. City planning, urban, economic, and scientific development in Bukhara had a large impact on the Islamic world in the Middle Ages. While in Bukhara we'd recommend taking a stroll around the old city to savor its architectural legacy and imagine yourself bargaining as they would have done in medieval times. Number 3 Kiva Ichakala, which literally translates as the inner part of the old city, is surrounded by thick mud walls. It contains 51 monuments and is although around 250 households still make their home inside, it feels more like an open-air museum. Take a guided tour to get to know the stories that feature in the history of this fascinating city. Number 4 Shahari Serbs this flourishing city of the Timurid Empire is the birthplace of the great medieval conqueror Amir Timur. Tamerlane's summer palace was one of the highlights of the Timurid architecture. These days you can still see the remains of the palace's 65-meter high monumental gates. Number 5 Tashkent Tashkent is the capital of Uzbekistan and with a population of 3 million people, it is the largest city in Central Asia. This large metropolis reflects the historical development of the country from its architectural monuments of oriental design to its Soviet planned street layout and its modern glass high buildings. Thus Tashkent today is a modern city with a wide variety of restaurants and shopping opportunities. Number 6 Aidarkul Lake in Nurota Mountains Aidarkul is a semi-artificial lake created as a result of Soviet agricultural planning. Today the lake covers an area of around 4,000 square kilometers, stretches for 250 kilometers in length and sits right in the middle of the Kizilkum Desert. It is a unique place to sleep in a yurt surrounded by desert and ride horses or camels. There are local guest houses where you can stay overnight and do some light hiking. Number 7 Termiz Few tourists ever venture as far south as Termiz. It's a pity as it is a place of exceptional historic importance and with a wealth of intriguing archaeological sites from pre-Islamic times. It is still possible to see the ruins of Kara TP and Fayaz TP, two important ancient Buddhist monasteries, plus the Kirkkai's fortress, and the archaeological museum is one of the best in Central Asia. You can visit the famous term as Archaeological Museum to learn about the millennia of history, where religions of Buddhism, Zoroastrianism, and Islam developed. Number 8 Ancient Fortress Ruins Ancient Khwarzm was known for its numerous fortresses rising above the deserts of Kizilkum. Most of them were settlements, fortresses with walls that could be seen from another fortress, and thus designed to help maintain control over the region and to pass on messages. There are numerous legends connected to each of these fortress ruins and rich archaeological finds. Number 9 Fergana Valley The Fergana Valley has been and still is an important crossroads for different religions, cultures, and nations. In Uzbekistan, the Fergana Valley is home to the important medieval silk road stops of Andijan, Kokand, Fergana, and Namangan. Its horses were known as heavenly horses and highly valued in China for several centuries. Number 10 Karakal Pakistan Nukus is the capital of an autonomous republic within Uzbekistan, Karakal Pakistan. 
though it can't measure up to Uzbekistan's Silk Road cities in terms of impressive architecture, it does showcase the history of the Karakalpak people with its beautiful jewelry, tapestry, and other national artifacts. One of the most intriguing museums to be found in Nukus is that which contains the Savitsky collection of art forbidden in the Soviet Union. What was once water is now a desert littered with the rusting hulks of ships, beached forever in a chilling reminder of the fragile balance between nature and humans.